Because when I saw it in the mirror, it was a bald ugly baby. And he got insanely mad about it. Then Pesmengold reacted to it, and now I'm reacting to that video. It's called Asmongold Can't Believe What Crusader Said to Seabad. And legendary. Um, there's a streamer <laughs> that called Sidu's infant newborn son uh. a bald ass uggo baby. <laughs> and uh, it's always funny. My, <laughs> it's always it, funny. It's, People are I'm saying true. People are saying funny. true because it's so true. I'm laughing because it's so fucking stupid. Well, no, it's it, definitely it's funny. Just, like, who the fuck does that? Like, uh, I mean, who, 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 brings a, who brings a baby into it? Good times. You know what I mean? Those things like, I'll, I'll play the clip, okay? I'll, I'll play the clip. I'll, I'll let you guys, um, uh, I'll let you guys <laughs> tell me what you think, okay? Uh. Didn't get rank oh, ones last season. Why five players. rank ones? Got five rank ones in one season. Why they don't even get one rank one? Because the legit most garbage players always have been, always will be. <laughs> Fucking disgusting. All right, so let's make this clear again. The Miestro got the most rank ones to ever exist. I'm the highest rated and best age pelling game. I get no opportunities even though I'm the absolute best. These people, I farm them in an arena. And I fucking... Uh, uh, what's it called? Make a complete name for myself while these people get carried by their organizations and play the game while getting paid and still are trash at it. Uh, and I still farm them into the ground, so they're so mad about it. So that when I call this baby a bald uggo, he was so mad about it because he knew not only was I way better than him in WoW, that he had a bald uggo baby. Big damn. Just out of nowhere. Just boom. Asmongold can't come to grips with it. Those kids played all season long and couldn't get rank one. While I literally get rank one, playing with the most garbage thirteen hundred fucktards who have IQ of literal dung beaters who can't even feed themselves or chew their own food, and I still get rank one every season. I get the most rank ones out of everybody. While these scum play together every single season, while I destroy them, and while I get uh, and they still can't get rank one. It's unreal. Five rank ones. Got five rank ones in one season. Why they don't even get one rank one because the legit most garbage players always have been, always will be. <laughs> Fucking disgusting, ugly baby. <laughs> Has been called literally can't comprehend. Fucking Just disgusting, ugly baby. They'll be. Out of nowhere. Fucking disgusting, ugly baby. There's a better one? Oh, really? Okay, let me see if I can, let me see if I can find it. Uh. Dude. Uh, give me a minute. Do you see the chat? How is it? The chat is... Uh, dude, whenever I'm in clips of other fucking streamers stream, the chat goes insane. Because I'm actually the best content you could ever have. Five, seven <laughs> day, right? I'm assuming. Seven days. Is this... A, no, this is seven days ago. What happened here? <laughs> he, he's watching other clips of me now. He's watching other... Ha ha ha. Oh, this is a good one, too. This is a good one. I can't believe all these clips are gone because I'm banned on Twitch, man. It's unreal. Holy shit. Holy shit, he's so bad. <laughs> Holy shit, he's so bad. Fuck. 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 Twitch man! Uh, <laughs> it was so fucking bad. Okay. Let's see if I can. Uh, is this. Oh, yeah. Dude, this the Miestro is the only person who can make himself laugh. Holy fuck. This is it. I, I think it is. Because I'm pretty sure I watched it. Okay. <laughs> Where is it? Uh, okay. <laughs> Dude, he made such a big de deal about this. When I was literally just making a joke, I'd never even seen his baby before. But I think he was just so mad about it because then I actually saw a picture of his baby and I realized he, I, we, were all, we all realized it was true what I said. <sighs> mm. Holy shit. Uh, because I just say random things about people in arena. Oh. 
But he made it such a big deal. It really. Oh god. Oh, I'm spitting. What <laughs> the fucking tone change, dude? He's going into Batman mode. <laughs> it's time to save this city. Like I watched this guy one time. I watched him do. It was the yeah. He didn't watch me one time. He's watched me a bunch of times. Boss in a tall bazaar. Me and Pesman Gold need to hang out. We both live in Texas now. I've talked to him a couple times. I talked to him during the freeze when he was standing in lines to get a, a fucking bottle of fucking Gatorade or whatever he drinks. He drinks like weird fucking Slurpees and stuff that he wakes in. He only eats fast food. I swear he only eats fast food. Sketchy SOB. And he spent like four hours on the last boss. <laughs> and he had to format it for his plus 15 for the week. <laughs> And this guy was just going absolutely <laughs> fucking ape shit about it. This guy, the, the it's called the fucking Prince Mice. Mm. And it was... Dude! Allow me to introduce you to the mattresses from Tufton. And... Yeah! Like, to be fair, pretty funny. Uh, it was. And... <laughs> but, like, making fun of the babies over the line. Wrong! Like it, it, that, that's Who gives a shit? It's a joke in arena. I don't even know what the baby looks like. I literally was just facing a random person in the arena. I don't even know if he had a baby. I don't give a shit. I don't ever pay attention to what Seabad does. All I know is how trashy is that. Wow. In my opinion, that's kind of over the line. I don't know how you guys feel about it. but uh, that's No one gives a fuck about the baby. The me issue is literally just making a joke. No one gives a fuck. Ah, uh, Seabad was just such a, such, he's such an unbelievable pansy leftist. That's a bit much. You know, I don't, so I watched his stream yesterday, and like, this is what <laughs> happens, right? Is like, as soon as somebody does something like this, everybody comes and just shits on him. And look at this, look at this, look at this. They, he links me in a tweet and tells everybody to report me. That's not considered doxing, but me saying a name... Of a guy who was scamming me out of money and me just trying to figure out who was scamming me and just saying his name is what got me permabanned. Yet this guy makes up th tweets that gets hundreds of likes and, and, and retweets, but he doesn't get banned for that and I get banned for that. How is that possible? It's because Twitch has a complete double standard. They're communists, they're scum of the earth, and they deserve to be, they, their poll platform should be deplatformed. It's disgusting. Um. I feel like they kind of like back him into a corner where they feel like they can't apologize. Because if they apologize... I would never uh, fucking apologize. I would say even more stuff. Unfortunately, I was on Twitch and couldn't say anything. Uh, these people are the biggest bitches. They literally cry and whine about everything. They're the disgraceful fucking scum. They've never had anything in their life. They're the biggest fucking crybaby wussy fucking pansies. They pick dandelions for a living and lick tree bark. They literally have nothing to fucking say and literally have no idea how to do anything in life. They're the biggest bitches to ever live. That's why they're so mad about it. They kind of like make all these other people that are like shitting on them like right, and so they just get defensive. Attacking streamers, money, attacking his family is a no-no. Well, uh, it was hilarious. Obviously, seeing as everybody in the chat thought it was funny, even Asmongold thought it was funny. Oh, it was, it was funny. Depends on what other people are comfortable with, right? It's like if you have a rapport with someone, then that's different. Like if the thi problem, so the thing is, what he's talking about. If you are, if you're like friends with someone, you can like talk to them. But like, Seabad's the kind of person who is like. You, he's such a fake, like, he's so fake. Like, so many of the streamers are the fakest scum, and then they get all these, because there's so many just fake people in the world. There's no just, like, real, like, just, like, there's very few people who are just, like, actually, like, real with what everything they do. Like, these people are just the fakest bitches who have piggybacked and used all these people. Why do you think C... Bad had has a stream at all. It's because he fucking stole viewers off Mitch Jones and Mitch Jones stole viewers off Wreckful. These people would never even have streams. I built up my stream from nothing with literally no help from anybody. And people uh and people purposely trying to undermine me and take me down. Like Seabad. And people like that. Trying to fucking ruin small streamers' lives. 
Uh, it's so fucking crazy, but the maestro rises above all like an absolute god tiered hero. People says that about me, then that's one thing. If, uh, you know, it, it depends on, on who it is. It's like you don't go... It has this swine get a hundo dot. Someone donate me a Chris Benji Frank! Like, you know what you say to your friend? Hey man, how's it going? You know what you say to your best friend? What's up, you stupid bitch? Do you want to get McDonald's? And that's what you say, because he eats fast food every day. The minister says, Time to strip his seat up, and we have a full gas tank. Try to drive to Oklahoma, motherfucker! And I will prowl these fucking streets for sexy biatches and knock on every fucking door in the neighborhood to find a hot daughter if I have to. And it doesn't mean that, like, oh, it's like saying that the baby will die or anything beyond edgy. It's just exaggerating. Well, no, it's like, obviously... It's like, it could be a lot worse, what he's saying. Yeah, no one cares that I called the bald uggo baby a bald uggo baby. Nobody, besides Seabad. But at the same time, you just probably so shouldn't fun. say that. It's like one of the situations where, it's like, the, the solution for this, in my mind, right, is like, just, just apologize for it and move on. Oh, definitely not. Right? I would never do that. Just like, Listen, you always never apologize to communist leftists. Who purposely try to ruin your life and try to take you down. You never apologize. You stand tall against the gremlin scum and you overcome their absolute treachery. Well, I'm sorry, my bad. All right, let's, let's move on. It was just like, whatever, right? Um, Especially because I'm not even wrong. And <sighs> it's like, if he doesn't do that, like, obviously Twitch might get involved and it'll be a big fucking thing. Yeah, Twitch banned me for a week. Scum of the earth. You know what I mean? But I think it's just because the, he doxed me. He doxed me, Twitch banned me. I say a guy's name, I get permabanned. Double standard. It's easier for everybody if people can just kind of resolve things personally. Uh, you, you know what I mean? I got permanently banned for saying a guy's name who scammed me. How? And uh, you should be banned after the security. <laughs> yeah, I know. But that's what that's the appeal to the stream, right? I mean, there's like people like responding to this. Yep, that's a ban. No one Look at that fucking bitch tally. That kid's the biggest fucking bitch. That kid literally fucking is fat as shit, fucking slobbering mutt bitch. That kid literally smokes his fucking hookah. What a fucking bitch this kid is. It's so crazy how these fake bitches like this kid fucking actually are allowed to fucking, um, uh, like, like, they're like such, like, sneaky snake vermin. Like, like, these people are the most unentertaining scum. They should literally not even have a platform because they're the most boring. Like, people, know, I don't understand why anyone would ever follow this because they got carried their entire lives. And then they come and try to ruin other people's lives because they have no lives themselves. The it's a fucking category. loser. Uh, something's not right in the old <laughs> Uh His person or whatever, person or whatever it may be, truly have on borderline TOS, so you can have my family or child definitely fucking weak. Uh, is this the guy who was commencing to abusing his mom on stream? Wrong. Yeah, there was, like, more to the story than that. I remember yeah, there's a lot more to the story, oh, moron. Maybe, maybe you should look at it. Reading into that. Um, he's just projecting his feelings of self-hatred onto others, bro. This is a guy who's bald and disgusting. Literally has a girlfriend who's 750 pounds. Kid's a no-life uh, loser. There you go, dude. That's, like, the, uh, that's the five-head take right there. Only solution is not Cora. Yeah, that makes no sense. The Miestro's life, will be, I will become rich and famous against all odds. I don't know. Um, he's telling his stream to make tweets about you. <laughs> There's no way I should be able to get banned for that, but you know my Twitch? Since he has, like, probably Twitch in his pocket. Yeah. He's like, he'll, try, he'll probably be able to get him banned. That's, pretty so, that's so fucked up. We should make tweets against him. And I was right. We should literally make tweets against him. <laughs> <laughs> you can't have a conspiracy if you talk about it in public. Hmm. It's not a conspiracy. It's true. You, you can't... Like, you can't have a... You have to talk about the conspiracies on, like, a hidden Discord channel, use the N-word, and then get exposed two years later. He's doing it all wrong. I'm surprised he didn't even... Let's say. I'm surprised. Uh, is there any more... Uh, any more of these? If you I got... said even say the N-word, I would have got banned on Twitch. They, they literally ban you for, like, breathing. Right, okay, I'll watch that one. Okay, um, maybe it's reverse conspiracy? Yeah, I guess so. Man, there's sides so many good clips, man. Holy shit. So fucked up. Twitch wants to see condoning. Uh, I mean, yeah, I, I feel like Twitch... The thing is that, like, if this was a job, like, yeah, maybe the guy just get fired outright because it's kind of, like, over the line. 
But if this was like me, I no. Could, if this was the job, Seabad wouldn't even been able to get hired because he's an incompetent peasant. I, I, I just try to work. I out. built up my stream from literally nothing. I had zero followers. I had no way to do anything. All these other people played with other people to get fucking all their viewers. Like, Seabad played with Peasant Jones and Wreckful every fucking day of his life and joined an or got, or got carried by an organization to get all his viewers and got carried by being at, like, all, in all the tournaments. Like, if I even had even slight of that amount, I already had, I already had one third of his followers. And I had only streamed for one year. He had been streaming since the beginning of Twitch. Imagine if I had been streaming since the beginning of Twitch. Well, I would have got banned on the first day, but... um, If I had been streaming since the beginning of Twitch, I would have the most followers on Twitch. I would have more than Ninja. I would have more than anybody. And fucking... That kid's the most... Uh, let's talk about that fucking bitch Ninja. That kid's the most entertaining fucktard to ever live, and he fucking somehow has viewers. It's actually crazy. Like, it's so crazy... How there's there's some people when I say some people I mean me who are the most entertaining people and don't ever and just don't get viewed and a lot of times it's because people try to hold them back just like these scum try to hold me back. Out with them, you know, like I, I like imagine if I got in, in an organization or was anybody or is ever able, able to play with people who had like a bigger stream like. I think Twitch should probably try to encourage people to work things out a little bit more, but you know it's like if this is an ongoing thing like here's. Here's the way I look at it, right? Is harassment, I'm not a fan of harassment. Oh, uh, it wasn't harassment. I called this baby uh, an uggo once. Really not a big deal. It's like not a big deal at all. No one gives a shit. And uh, he's a pig. He's a huge, huge peasant. But um, it's so crazy how like with just one touch of a button, you oh, your entire, uh, your entire fucking way you make money is just gone over the internet. It's the most sickening thing. Harassment is bad. But I think that, like, the frequency of harassment and the length of the harassment matters. So, like, if you say one bad thing about one person, that's one thing. But if you say a 50 bad things about the same person, that, in my opinion, is something <sighs> else. So, I, I think those are, like, two completely different worlds. Anyway, uh, here was It wasn't harassment. I didn't even give a fuck about this kid. I was fighting him in an arena. Like, in a video game. These kids, like, it's it's so dumb. Today? I know, thank you. Uh, it's not harassment, it's, it wasn't targeted, and I regretted it. Mm -hmm. Well, I mean, then, then maybe just an apology, right? I, I mean, then, you know, it is something. But it is kind of like, it's a dumb thing to say. It's pretty uh, funny. Never said this apology, no farther on words. It's really it's funny. Thing. Well, it's like, I, I think that, it's like if you say something, you get really mad, and it's like a heed to the moment thing. I don't know. Oh, I wasn't mad at all. I was just acknowledging how trashy is in an arena. Oh, like I would just, I, I would look at it differently. Like people have said bad shit to me before in the past, and it's been like, okay, yeah, he's just pissed off, like whatever, right? Uh, like there's been plenty of streamers and like just other people that have just like gotten really mad at me, and it's just like a heat of the moment thing. They're pissed off, and then they just move on, right? It's not like a personal thing. So I don't know. It's between him and this guy. I don't know their history, but that's like kind of my opinion about. It. Does it matter if uh, the history is really simple. I farm Seabad in Arena. He's insanely mad, so try to get me banned on Twitch. True, though? Well, of course it, it doesn't matter. So it depends on how you say it, right? So if I say somebody's an ugly, fat idiot, and they're actually an, There's a lot of those. an ugly, fat idiot, I'm still the asshole, right? No. No, you just acknowledge that they're an ugly, fat piglet. That's the way it should be. If there's a fat bitch walking down the street, you're like, holy fuck, that bitch is fat as fuck. Stop putting fat bitches on your fucking cover photos. So it doesn't really, I mean, like, that's, that's really what it comes down to, right? I mean, so it, does it matter? Like, yeah, to an extent it matters, but at the same time, it's not like that makes it good. That's well, pretty so, good. Uh, it's a baby, yeah. Is that about the kid's cute? Well, I just... Cunningham, buddy, you know, you know what time it is. It's time to Chris Benji Frank hit the fuck up. I need one more than every year before. Buddy, you didn't get home from the gym. You got home from buying the gym because you're rich. Now donate to the maestro. No! matter like that who gives a shit like that's completely Not again. outside of the conversation uh taking bad shit to you is completely different than your child when you'll have one you'll see no i, I didn't say it was completely no it's not different no one gives a shit i said i didn't even say anything bad no one cares completely different right obviously it's mm. bad it's like the equivalent of like somebody saying bad shit about my mom right and, i would love for people to say bad shit about c Lori. and like if somebody said that mm. like bad shit about my mom i've had people do that before and i'm like okay yeah you're a piece of shit but if you apologize, uh, I, I will probably only hold it against you for like, you know, a month or so, right? And then I'll move on. 
And uh, it's like, if you don't like, it's not like, it's, it's like, is it worse or better than your mom? Like, I don't know. I think they're both bad, right? I mean, you can decide, like, which one. I is would good. love a sexy mom. <laughs> you know, I love grannies. Mm, I love a juicy granny ass. Mm, 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 delish. In your own mind. Mm. Either way, uh, it, it's a dumb thing to say. Like, let me just say, it, it is a dumb thing to say. So, yeah, it's different for everyone. Uh, that's just what my perspective is. All right, your video is getting boring, Pesmengold. We, I really should do a stream with Pesmengold, but now he, we, even if we hung out, we wouldn't be able to uh, stream because I'm banned on Twitch. But it would still be fucking hilarious if we made a video together or did like anything. Someone that can't insult back. Hmm. Uh, I don't think that he even like. I watched the stream. I genuinely think that he he's always drinking food. Wendy's. He's literally always drinking fast food. Anything wrong with it? Like yeah. he just just said it. And like he didn't see anything wrong. Yeah, with it. there's nothing wrong with it. It's just like because it was true. Stupid, but you know it is what it is. We've only had a game, yeah. Oh, it's so funny. That's actually true, CP. I personally think so CD is to blame for having the child. Yeah. If he didn't have, uh, if he didn't, then Crusader wouldn't have made the comment. That's so what I've been trying to say. Responsibility and actually apologize to Crusader. Yeah, we've all been thinking that. Mm. Holy fuck. Big Dan. Oh, that was a good one. My 3X! Part 7000! Time to win, mother-